people are in need of people with integrity there's a version of you that cannot get the blessing if you have not developed that level of handling it who is a father hello who is a father okay now before i go into who is a father what father is you will discover also that when at the beginning to tell you how important a father is when satan came in at the beginning came to attack came to meet eve now satan was not after eve he was after adam why because adam was the one carrying the seed and the seed symbolized the future so if i can get eve i can get what adam quickly what's the word father the word father means abba in Hebrew, and it simply means what happened daddy daddy now in in, in greek it is called pata pata okay pata what does he connote number one he connotes foundation someone say foundation say foundation Say foundation. Say foundation. Now the father is the foundation. Is the founder. Is the foundation. Just like you have God, the Father, Almighty, is the foundation of everything that is created. So the foundation of a family is built on the man. So the man is the foundation. Okay, and the foundation is very important. So that is why no matter how, if the man is not at home, if the man does not take his place, his responsibility, then that home will be in trouble because every, every structure is built on a solid foundation. Hello? When the father is not there, at the end of the day, you might be building and building. And when it gets to some time, thank God for our wonderful mothers. They have done well. When it gets to some certain times, listen to me, the foundation happens. It affects the children, especially the male figures in the family. So the man is the foundation and is the anchor. And is the anchor. Now, what happened? Don't forget that you need the anchor. Hello? You cannot have the woman as the foundation. The man is the anchor and is anchored to the rock, which is Christ. So when the storm comes, as long as the man is anchored, the family will not scatter. Can I talk to someone here today? Number two quickly is the man is also called the source. The source. Okay. Abba, which is father, also means the source. Okay, God is called our Father because He's the source of all creation. That means to say that the man, which is the man, he carries the seed. If the word sperm, uh, seed is called sperma. In Greek, it's called sperma. Okay, it's sperma. Okay, that's a seed. Now, every seed needs a womb. Where the seed without a womb, the seed will be dormant. Even though it has the potential to become a nation or become great, it cannot become great, but it needs a womb. So the woman is a recipient, which is a womb, a recipient of the seed. Hello? She's the one that gives life to the seed. Everything in life has a womb. If you even plant your seed, when you plant your seed, your, your what you call it, your cassava, whatever it is, or mango, you know, whatever it is, you put it in the ground. Now, that ground is a womb. Okay? He receives it. And you see that that seed, when you, have you ever taken a maize seed? The maize. You see it's very strong. Okay? You see there's no light there. But when you put it to the ground, which is the womb, it begins to germinate. It brings forth. After some time, it breaks out. And it begins to grow. He needs a womb. So the man is the source, which is the seed. But the woman is what? Is the one, is the recipient, is the one that gives life to the seed. So where the man is not there, then there's no way also that they can produce the seed. So that is why we say that the man is the source. Why the woman is the what we call incubator incubator praise the name of the lord number three also 
The man is also a sustainer. The sustainer. Okay, the sustainer. He sustains the values. He sustains the traits. For example, there are some traits, some characters that are transferred from generation to generation. It is embedded in the man most times. Okay, it is transferred. And then the man also, don't forget, is a sustainer of the value system. So that is why when you have a man that becomes an alcoholic, he says a father, now he has, he has the raid. Okay? You have a man that is, uh, what I call it, drug abuser. He's into taking cocaine, Indian hemp, he smokes and everything. Now that is not the father we're talking about. Okay? He's there to sustain the value. He passes the value to what happened to the children. Okay, and from there it is transferred from generation to generation. So the man is a sustainer of it. Number four, the man is a protector of the family. Okay, now the father, anywhere the father is, the female, either a teenager, either his child, either the child of somebody else, either a youth that is a woman or a grown up woman, they ought to be very, very safe. The father protects. The children it protects the family is a protector of the family that is why it is abnormal for you to abuse what you are ordained to protect not knowing the purpose of a thing leads to abuse of purpose say my small can i talk to someone today hello so if you don't know the, uh, the importance of fatherhood you will abuse it okay that is why you see people abuse their children you have child abuse so, you as a father, women should feel comfortable with you at any point in time. They should feel that no matter what happens, you will protect them. They should not be afraid of you. Rather, they should be what? They should be very comfortable with you. Knowing that you will not beat them. A wife bitter is not a protector. You don't know the importance of wife. That's why you beat your wife. Can I talk to someone here today? Hello? You don't know the importance of why. That's why you beat your wife. You are meant to protect. So you are frustrated because what you want how to operate, you don't know how to operate. So as the system is not working, you are, you are compared to use whatever you think to do. Let me beat her. My, my father used to beat my, 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 my mother. When he comes back drunk, he used to beat my mother. So therefore, I feel that women should be obedient if they talk and he'll slap them. Now, that is the what is in your subconscious which is wrong because you don't know and that is why it's important that what happened that men come to the house of god they they, they they comes to the manufacturer when you come to the house of god you listen from the manufacturer we took from the book which is the manual if you buy a product for example you cannot know more than the manufacturer every manufacturer before he builds any product Okay, he has a purpose for the product. For example, now this microphone, before they started a show, made this business, they had a purpose. The purpose must be defined before they, before they manufacture it. What's the purpose? The purpose is to edify my voice, to voice of people. And so they do it based on the purpose. And they keep the manual and said to you, just in case, so and so and so, for you to operate well, do like this, do like this, do like this. But supposing I take this microphone, I just see it like that and say, Oh, no need to read the manual. What happened? This thing is sounding. And then I go and I said, I hit drum. When I hit the drum, it's making noise. I said, This thing is good for making beating drum. So I take it and begin to beat drum. Hello? What have I done? I have abused it. At the end of the day, I will not get the result I get to. It will end up destroying the drum and destroying this. And I said, Why is this? So it ends up frustration. What am I doing? I'm experimenting because I never read the book. That is why it's important that men come to church. They hear from the manufacturer. God is the manufacturer and the manual. And then he has sent people, a special dealer, to help to teach. And God has raised us to help to teach you based on the word. And the more you know this word, the more you understand your function. And the more you begin to function properly. And you see that you will never be frustrated again. Can I talk to someone there? And it means to say there is no more experiment because you know the formula. And so when situation comes, you apply the formula and you get the result. You just go home and rest.